When I was 15, the doctor explained to me what was going to happen. My mom started to cry, and that's when I knew it was serious. Jack's condition caused him to be completely blind since birth. When I first found out I had Storger's disease, I was scared. I was scared I wouldn't be able to see my family. In college, we won the Campus Intramural Men's Volleyball Championship. I was the spiker. The next year, I couldn't see the ball well enough to play. The gene for retinitis pigmentosa is passed through the women in my family. I carry it, my daughter carries it, and now my grandson is affected. Six years ago, when my first granddaughter was born, I could see her face, and it was adorable. Today, I cannot. I play the violin in my school orchestra. I also swim, and my dream one day is swimming for the Paralympic team. She's going to fulfill all of her dreams, but anything we can do to fight her going blind, we'll do it. Research funded by the Foundation Fighting Blindness has already developed treatments that have stopped vision loss. In one clinical trial, 40 people got their vision back. I would like my grandson to be independent, to be able to drive a car to pick up a date and perhaps to his wedding someday. I want Jack to be able to go to college, to make new friends, and to find a job that he loves. I want my parents to know peace of mind that I'm okay. We need to think of retinal degenerative disease like past generations thought of polio. We can wipe it out completely. There's real hope that we can find a cure. It's not a question of if, but when. Millions of people are waiting for treatments. We, we need more research. research. When my sight got worse, I set out to travel the world for two months. I crowdsourced where I went and what I did to raise awareness for vision issues. We were so surprised at how many family and friends wanted to support us. I've had my own campaign to end blindness for two years. Sign up to do your own fundraising to end blindness. The foundation has made it easy to start. Come on, people. Let's raise some money.